Hello everyone and welcome to Fun and Knowledge. Today we are going to have a walk around Banff National Park, Alberta, Canada. So if you are an enthusiast traveler, this video is going to be very interesting for you. Let's get started. January 1st, New Year's Day morning. We're going to Lake Louise, which is in the Rocky Mountains Banff National Park. Good! The signals seem to be favorable from the first day of the new year. Please click the like button, subscribe, and set notifications. Your enthusiasm greatly aids in the development of the upcoming content. The Rocky Mountain region's emblematic lake is Lake Louise. On January 1st, New Year's Day, I stroll across that big ice lake. The name Lake Louise, which was once known as Emerald Lake, was changed in 1884 to honor Princess Louise, the fourth daughter of Queen Victoria of England. There are numerous British royal names associated with the Canadian Rockies. The Victoria Mountains and Glacier are named after Queen Victoria. Additionally, Prince Albert, the spouse of the Queen, is honored by the state of Alberta, where the lake is situated. Three mountain peaks around Lake Louise. To the left is Mount Aberdeen. Lefroy, the ice cap's highest point, is to the right. And in the center sits Victoria Mountain, which is surrounded by expansive glaciers. I had never before seen the enormous, snow-covered rocky mountains or the lake's wide area. It leads me to believe that if there were a garden of the gods, 
it would resemble this. I now question if I'm walking on the ice of the lake or a huge area of land as I continue to go along Lake Louise where the snow is beginning to sputter. I am unable to tell them apart. Lake Louise Falls can be seen frozen on the lake's right side. The number of frozen waterfalls is impressive, just like the waterfalls themselves. Far off in the distance, towards the direction of the lake's entrance. Visible is the Fairmont Chateau Lake Louise Hotel, which dates back to the 1890s. The hotel is surrounded by lofty mountains, gleaming glaciers, and sparkling lakes. As much as its long and rich history, it is also enjoyed by tourists. That's all for today. We will meet again with a new and exciting video soon. Please stay tuned and hit the like and subscribe button. Please share your reviews about the video in comment section. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.